Hello, what is then? My name is Olivia Kutro and welcome back to Phoenix Wright. It's a Tony. Case 3. Turn about summarize. <laughs> um, I will uh, record the uh, episodes on the same day as the last part. And uh, well, we'll begin right away with the coolest testimony here. Yeah. I wanted to see us as the summer as you so just once. I found a map on the internet and went to the studios that day. I went through the woods of the path that thought lady would catch me. I was going for the studio. I got kinda lost on the way though for t about 30 minutes. When I came out by the studio there was this was this the samurai. It totally rocked. Right before my eyes out came the bad guy. Of course this the samurai took it down. Pow! If we had a camera with me that uh, would have been the time for shot to tell you. Anyway, I couldn't get into the studio, so I went home. Hmm, I went a well the defense may make it is cross examination. A bit gentle, remember you took it to child. This kid is harder than most of those we, s we see it here, honestly. He said before the trial, he said that uh, he always took a camera with, this, with him. And then he said, If you had my camera, you would have a great shot. But Cody, what you said you seemed a little, little strange. Did you say before that you always bring your digi digital camera wherever you go? You were quite clear about that. Huh? Cody, you should lie here. You understand that, right? Is that right? Oh, where would you? Uh oh, was I putting a pressure to watch? Not to watch. What is this digital camera co co contraption you're talking about? It's a, a digital camera. Di di a digital camera, you know. It's kind of a new sort of camera. How do you explain that? I see. Anyway, Cody, I can't believe you would bring your camera on a trip to the studios. You did bring it, did you? Mr. Wright. Mr. Wright, how cruel you are, you are to tear us up poor child, so. I don't care if it's a child or a prose prosecuting attorney. No one should lie in court. What do you mean by it? What do you mean? Or a prosecution authority. Prosecution authority. <laughs> Why, Cody? Uh, what? Yeah, so you have my camera, so what? You got a problem with that? So, did you have a camera? And did you use this camera? Uh, why, would, why would you use it? I, I was too busy watching. Hmm, well, well, please stop trying to record about what you were busy watching. Yeah, I had my camera with me, but it was so glued to her action I couldn't take my eyes off. The steam summary key goes for the bad guy, wow! Then, did the bad guy stop moving? He's so strong, the steam summary rules! Oh, is that all? Uh, well, that was brief. Uh, I'm busy right to cross examination. I have to take a little break, so I will be right back. Okay, now I'm back again. I have to prepare dinner. <laughs> Anyways, what I saw. And you have a camera with me. But it was good reaction, I couldn't take my eyes off it. I see somebody goes for the back guy. Well, <laughs> Did you watch a whole fight? Y yeah, of course! You didn't turn away, not even once. N no! Okay, then tell us exactly what happened. Y yeah, I get it to that! Oh, 
guess I'll hope this is it right. Does this is right because he's been de delivered a badge? Badge? Please present our facts, Phoenix. Find out what is on. Attacked him first. Yeah. What's the what's the what's the what's the, what's the person was this bad guy? I told you, person. It was a person. Who was he dressed? I can't don't remember. I was too busy watching this day samurai. I see. you So what happened next? The the bike has stopped moving. <coughs> Why? Huh? What do you mean, why? Why was the bad guy moving? Well, well cause this is how I brought him to justice! And who is that did he do that? Uh, how did he do it? With a summer kick and summer punch! Summer shop and summer slap! S something like that. He's still being a fag about it. <coughs> what? Don't give me that look, Pops! Who should we first play this? First of all, uh, Cody? Cody? What? Something's bothering me. Before you said that you couldn't take your eyes off the action. Y yeah So what? Yet you missed the most important part. What is the meaning of this? The witness has stated that it's all quite clearly. You know as well as I do that he's been vague. Vage, vage, you vage. Tell me what kind of murderer uses a summer shack? <laughs> My point is this, Cody, you may have seen some of this year's summer's fight. But you missed the most important part, the fight killing blow. Order, order, Mr. Wright, what could this be? Can you explain how we have missed something so visual, Michael? Uh, well, th that's the thing, uh, uh, Phoenix, I believe you are on the right track with this. Think, why did you Cody see the climbs of the fight? I know you, you can feed yourself. Mr. Wright, your answer. We will have a certain that this young boy is quite a fan of this day's samurai. Why would they, why couldn't they watch the climbs of fight? <laughs> he missed the climbs of the fight because he was looking at something else. Probably. Probably. Something else? Mr. Wright, to explain yourself. What could possibly distract this boy from seeing his idol this day's samurai fight? How do you claim that for... He was looking at. Oh, come on, take off something. Take off something. Nothing. Uh, Mr. Wright, please refrain from making ba baseless games. Y yes, sorry, Owen. Uh, do you have any other explanation for this? He uh, <laughs> was looking at the camera. <laughs> because it was. He couldn't find it. Evidence? Yes, Your Honor. Why did uh, they call him look away for a fight? Because of this! Here's my proof. What's that? The camera? The wit the witness stated that he received a uh, recently recently received this camera. Yes, I'm aware of that. He was not entirely familiar with this operation. I'm aware of that too. Oh correct. Why could the Cody be looking so uh, why would Cody look be looking somewhere else in the critical moment? Because he was looking at his camera. He was trying to take a picture. Hey! Bullseye! What's the problem, Bowser? You gotta take a... Take for picking up little kids? Pressing, not picking. Good job, Phoenix. Cody was like, clearly. Sort of you to rest there was no way you could just stand... You stand there watching his hero and not take a picture. Right. Cody, there was only one reason why would you... Why you would look at... Look away from the fight. And that was because you wanted to take a picture. But having you received your camera, you weren't used to using it yet. So you missed the climax of the fight, correct? Yeah. Well, Phoenix, I will bet, I bet you would. You, editing is tiny more than that. How do you just fight again? R right, we have his business. The other, the defense would like to request the Colonel Hawkins to testify. Hackett's uh, to survive once more. Uh, very well, Cody. 
Could you please tell us about your camera and about, uh, about why you did take a picture of the fight? Um, but go to the river, kid. No follow? Yeah, you're right, Pops. The stairs that we had just escaped from the cottage of the villain. Villain. So he had a, had a back camera to take a picture, but it has put open the time, so he missed. Missed it. Th that's all what happened, yep. Hmm, any demonstrations that any demonstration that has already been destroyed? I'm not sure. But I would like to proceed with the cross examination anyway. Yeah, you're right, Pops. <coughs> <laughs> so you did see the beginning of the fight? Yeah. Did you notice anything unusual? Um, well, uh I guess this is almost moving a little strange. Moving strangely. What did you open? What did you see? Ah, uh, well, a person on the ground, and this is alright. I couldn't take a picture. My new camera has too many buttons. I couldn't figure it out. I tried to take a picture and really tried. Exactly what happened today. You took a picture. Hey! Bullseye. Bullseye? How, how did you know? I see it. I see through all your lies, Colonel Hawkins. Hawkins is one of my powers. <laughs> wow! This feels great. <laughs> yeah, 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 I took a picture. <clears throat> Perhaps you can change your testimony to reflect the score. I took a bird just, but it was too late. I erased them. You erased them? I yeah! Why did you erase a picture of Royal Beloved's Tits? How are you victorious? Well, you know, why, why would why would I want a pic to keep a picture like that? Hmm, he's been given a sense that's cooperating. I'm going to find a clear contradiction as soon as this seems. What can it be called? The church doesn't have to be. There has to be something. You fall it with something bad. I just wanted to thank you for giving me this the other day. Huh? Oh, all right. What was it? Uh, what? Uh, what was it? Do you be told? Uh, told me about? I got to every live performance, performance. I always take a picture when I see someone dance and find a blow. Bazaar, bazaar, bazaar. I got them all, and every wish one and a perfect collection. <laughs> 
flashback while it... <laughs> Cody? Cody, did you really get that picture of a Stacey Summer Static Week towards over his phone? If you did, I find it hard to believe that you would release it. Would you keep it for your album? Ah! Mr. Wright, what exactly is this album? It's called Path of to Glory. It's a collection of pictures of the same summer all taken by Cody and Cody Hackett. He claims it's a perfect collection of every band in the same summer as well. I, I see. Don't you, don't you find this very odd, Jonah? What will this picture, this picture of the same summer not over taken on the day? On the day. <coughs> Order! Mr. Wright, have you, exp have you an explanation? You just see someone who had just defeated his address soon. I certainly would expect you to see a picture of this album. Exactly my point, Your Honor. <laughs> no! Wait! No way! Phoenix, I think we have finally discovered the truth. I want through this. I want through to this. Me, are you sure about this? Did he ask like, exact. actually. Yes, I'm pretty sure what you had to, uh, taken is right. Tell the Phoenix, tell them what the truth is. Mr. Wright, do you expect to record what is going on? Why was there a picture in the album from the day of the murder? Why would the boy have at least the portal to the blah blah The only explanation is the steel summer did you win. I take off only one reason, you know. The steel summer did you win. That's why Corey deleted his photos. You mean the steel summer lost? Well, Cody, I'm right, aren't I? Tell the truth, the bad guy defeated the samurai. No, no, no way, no! It's impossible, it's the steel samurai never loses! He never loses to anyone, ever! In the order, the witness had revealed some everything with his words. There was a reason why he lied and told us he didn't do a picture. The same reason he raised his precious portals. For Cody, it was <coughs> inconceivable that the steel samurai could be defeated. However, according with this is impossible. It's not a steel summer loose. Yet to admit that what he saw would destroy everything he believed in. That's why he lied and said that steel our steel summer war. He could have the truth. Oh, order! Order, I will have order! W witness, I mean, Cody, is this true? What did you see? Tell the court what you saw. I. Good thing I'm sick. <laughs> Cody, that day you saw the stairs of a loose of fight, right? <laughs> okay, okay, <laughs> you're right. The stairs of a fell down. The did it, did move. Order, order, order. <laughs> What kind of stunt are you trying to put right? This disarmor was the murder, not the victim. Yet according, yet according to you, with this testimony, this disarmor was the one who fell. Mr. Wright, what's going on? Apparently we, apparently we have all made a serious, serious error. An error? What's this all about? Was weak. If you understand what the hell happened, it's quite, quite simple. At the end of the fight, the stay somewhere come to the ground and they still. In other words, the stay somewhere was not the killer, he was the victim. But you see, Yakama was the stay samurai. Order, order, order! So the, so the stay samurai in the photograph. You were saying that bloody little costume was the victim, you know, Mr. Yakama? That's what I say, your honor. Yakama was, <coughs> was present at the action, so she had run through her body. Does she obviously do what will power stage footage? But, but wait! Had Mr. Haru gone through the stream one already? That's what everyone thought. But remember what Mrs. Obax said in her testimony. On the day of the murder, <coughs> I arrived at the guard station at 1 pm. Did I see, did I see poor, poor old Haru? No! He thought I got to the studio before they got back to the guard station. So you have left the employer real for lunch. However, no one saw him go to the studio. So no there was a picture of him. 
you wait to you wait for Mr. Powers to take a nap at his dressing room. Then it's okay to interest in the rest of your size design costume. But why would you put the two such a I I don't know. I get it. I thought that this design room was very strange. So it was a different person decided soon. Pops! Her uh, me? What? Actually, actually there was one piece of data saved. Data? Yeah, a photo of it on the digital camera! What? 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 Show us quick! No way, man! Not if you're gonna look at me like that! No! Here, here this is it! Well, look at this. It's still a little hard to say. I'm afraid that there couldn't be anyone in the costume. Your opinion is right. I agree, Your Honor. This is this is the same evidence. But so, this doesn't look this doesn't look like it's a proof of need. I will give it back. Why, Felix? Be a what? Look at the photo once more. That's it. That's it, Felix. The photo is all the evidence you need to win this trial. What? what? Uh, Your Honor, uh, may I see the photo once more, please? Certainly, uh, so certainly, I, I don't see any why not. Felix, show him. There's a glaring to see him in closer to with the fact that we know what they read for them. Right, right there. It's number two there. <coughs> Take that! Your Honor, look at this. I see a gate. Why to draw your attention to the number of the gate? The num number? Uh, yes, well, it's hard to see, but it looks like a number two. Clearly not a one, the order. Correct? Ah! Oh! I believe Mr. Edgeworth sees what I'm getting at. <coughs> but, but, but that's impossible. Hmm? And what's this all about? Please explain to me what they might be shocked to the log. <laughs> I'll use this to the feedback. The body was put here, this to the wall. However, what we saw and see in this photo taken out of the world, there is not one, but two. Here's the crew. Drug I'm seeing. <laughs> oh, sorry, I don't want to call. <laughs> Here, at the room. I see, uh, that would explain the number two on the gate in the photo. The order I find it very significant. That the photo took place into the room. Those films not there. The two stone, uh, the two stone will be ever used for filming. I see, uh, it is a significant lie. Gosh, I really should teach this one too long. <laughs> we are to uh, take another stab at it, so to speak. S stabbing away, Your Honor. Your Honor, uh, I find it very significant that we are to go through the because the path was blocked. The path to the trailer was blocked. <laughs> so we heard the path was blocked at 2.15. In other words, the victim was to do the two, went to I <laughs> went to Studio 2 before this time. What a time. Yeah, yes, I suppose that would be the case. Remember Mr. Remember Mr. Bonnell's, uh, Mr. Bonnell's testimony? I went to write the court. He said no one in the was guilty because they could have not come to Studio 1. Yet it, it, it asked, ex, ex, ex doubt, it, the reverse was true. Only someone in the trailer could have committed the murder. They were only ones with the access to receipt of the crime to Studio 2. As a waiter called, there is a trailer in Studio 2. No, no, on that day a meeting was held in the trailer. It was a break in the meeting was corresponding to the time of death. During that break, Mr. Salman and I missed the Vasquez was a man that was at stake. They were at the scene of the crime. <laughs> order, order! The defense make, makes, makes the following case. The scene of the crime was to the true. First, that the security guard we saw that someone was to be coming up Mr. Young Black Hammer. Mr. Hammer was for some reason sold a for some reason sold a costume. And they went to stop you. This is madness. Young Hammer is the victim. The victim. Why would he steal some if we steal a steel sound but uh steal some costume? I also guess the idea that's to come up the details of the old murder. Well, no, of course not. Hmm. Or do we have proof? Give me proof that the victim was the uh, uh, yeah, that the camera uh, proof. <coughs> proof. You do. You you do. You 
do this right? Well, that is a surprisingly fair bit of brush less confident. I take it right, though. Here's my proof record of how I saw the costume. This sleeping pill bottle. This is it. A medicine bottle? I thought this on the table in the Gloria. The same table where Mr. Happer and Mr. Power say the eight that Devin says sleeping pills. Sleeping pills? The defendant Mr. Power spent the entire afternoon sleeping. He was drugged by Mr. Happer. Wait a moment, the bottle does rise so suspicious, yes, but there's no proof that Mr. Happer used it. Don't I have an idea? <laughs> Fingerprint! Oh, a dear, we don't well this it. I want to check this block of your fingerprints. If my claims are true, Mr. Power's fingerprint should be on the bottle. Uh, I suppose you're right. Very well. The court will take possession of the bottle. Have the bottle give it a reach. Okay, this episode was limited. The court suspects the proceedings on the court of trial of today. Cody Haggis test what else real. Possibilities in the case. In fact, think you may have made it happen very differently but than we previously thought. The slaves are perceived by this open way of being viewed by the camera. The scene of the crime was not to do one, but two. And thus, in the trial, they did have time to commit murder. Is right? Yes, sir. Your homework today is to find the answer to the folding question. Why would Mr. Howard steal the steel samurai costume? Also, who killed it and why? Find the answer for the bite tomorrow. For me tomorrow, by tomorrow. That's a lot of homework. Mr. Edward, hmm? You will need to you will need to re reconsider your stats in this case. Above all, you need to reconsider re re your suspicion of Mr. Will Powers. I should say, Your Honor. This trial will be extended into tomorrow. This is a last extension. <coughs> well, well, court is assured. Who you are? Okay, guys, uh, how to end this episode? Sorry. Anyways, uh, <laughs> it, uh, this episode was longer than I thought because of the break and all that. <laughs> uh, wait a minute, it did pause, but uh, whatever. Anyways, uh, thank you for uh, watching. Leave a like, comment, and subscribe, and I hope to see you in the next episode. Bye bye.